Megan, and I'm so excited to welcome you back to Newmar's campus today to walk you through our 2022 Ventana 4326. I just want to go ahead and focus on a few things here. So in our front, you're also going to have our, um, our generator is going to be focused up front. So it's going to be an eight kilowatt Onion Cummins generator. You're also going to come with comfort drive steering and passive steer, which means on our 40 foot and above, you're going to get that second tag axle in the back. What you're gonna see with our new Mars is our massive windshields, but something I wanna point out and something you'll see that's different from our competitors is our windshields are actually gonna be bonded to the coach. Um, so a lot of competitors don't do that, which makes this a little bit different. Gives you that automobile-like kind of feel. Up front too with our paint, what you're gonna have on the front is gonna be a diamond shield protection on our front cap. You're also gonna have the front camera, which gives you that 360 view if you option that in. You're gonna have a new Mars badge plate underneath here. This is here just to protect it through transit, but that's going to be stainless steel. And then I want to go ahead and focus real quick on our side convex mirrors here. So these are going to be remote control. They're going to have your turn signal indicators, and they're also going to be auto defrost. Moving to the door side here, I want to go ahead and point out a few things focusing right here. So what you're going to see is um, our floor pan, like I said, is going to be the 4326. So a lot of people don't actually know that the 43 stands for the length of the coach, and 26 is actually going to stand for the floor plan. Right above it, you're gonna have your Numar um, door assist handle here along with your um, automated pin and doorbell. So you can actually go ahead and customize your um, safety pin. This is just added protection for security, obviously, and um, who doesn't love a good doorbell? Along with this, a cool feature is if you hold and press the one button, it's actually gonna lock all of your doors, including your baggage doors underneath. Over here, we're going to have um, featured is going to be our Belmont graphics. So that's going to be one of three options available to you. Something here at Newmar that we pride ourselves on is going to be a couple things you'll hear throughout the videos are going to be standards, options, and specials. So this is going to be one of our standard options. However, here at Newmar, you can actually go to one of our dealers and customize your special paint if you want. That'll be an additional cost, but a lot of people like to do that. They like to customize that. And um, throughout the coach, you can also custom design it. Over here, you're gonna have your diesel fuel tank. So this is actually gonna be dual sided so you can feel from either side if um, you're pulling into the truck stop and you know you don't wanna have to turn around, you're kinda driving a 43 foot thing. You can do it from both sides and people won't get angry at you. We're gonna go ahead and just touch on some of the bays here. So opening up bay one, you're just gonna have a nice open base space. You're gonna have insulated um, flooring along with our bead foam on the side walls here. Moving into bay two, you're going to go ahead and have a pull out tray. So we'll go ahead and demonstrate that for you. So you're going to just pull up and pull out. So this is actually going to be a full pass through so you can open it from either side and pull it out from either side as well. Before we move into bay three here, I want to actually open up both two and three because I want to focus on our star foundation, which you get a good glimpse of right here. So our star foundation stands for strong, true, and robust. And it's actually gonna be a Numar exclusive um, steel superstructure, which is built on your chassis. So for instance, um, this Ventana is built on our Freightliner chassis, which comes with a 400 horsepower. But with um, the 43 foot, you can actually option in a Spartan if you choose to. But what you're gonna see here are going to be these diagonal um, frames here. So these steel beams are going to take that weight of the coach from the exterior and move that all the way back into the center. So what that provides you is strength, durability, and integrity of your coach and your chassis. It's also gonna give you a quieter and a little bit more stable of a ride. You're gonna feel a little bit less of the bumps going down the road. And then just as I touched on the um, star foundation here, bay three is gonna be another full pass-through tray. So it's um, available to open on either side. It's obviously great for luggage. If you have larger items, maybe you're going hiking or hunting, you have um, your equipment that's great for it. And moving into bay four, you're gonna have another manual tray. So it's not gonna be a full pass through, but you're gonna, what you're gonna see is it's gonna be a lot wider than our other ones. And then you're also gonna have two 110 outlets over here if needed. Um, you're also gonna have your central vac system. So if you option that in, this is the bay that you're gonna have all that dust and grime and you can, are gonna clean it out from this bay. Moving into bay five. So you're just gonna have your pegboard. 
Um, for example, my mother-in-law actually has a pegboard in hers and she uses it for her crafts. So she'll put cute little racks in here. She'll keep all of her crafts neatly organized um, and just make sure that you kind of take that storage out of the inside for you. Moving to the rear here, what you're going to have is going to be your back radiator is going to be featured back here. So this is going to be your access point. You're also going to have your rear camera, which is going to be that optioned in 360 view camera. You're going to have your tow hitch along with your brake sync system, which comes on your Freightliner chassis. Again, this one is built on our Freightliner chassis, which comes with 400 horsepower. And then I just want to go ahead and point out the Newmar badge plate along with the Belmont graphics on the back here. And as we make our way here to the off door side, we're gonna go ahead and pull our bays just as we did on the other side here. So in your first bay here, this is gonna kind of be your switchboard. So you're not gonna have a lot of, to do with this, but if you go into service and they ever ask where your electrical panel is or anything like that, you're gonna have in this bay here. As we mentioned on the other side, it's gonna be a dual fuel tank. So that's gonna be your diesel fuel. So here in bay two, you're gonna have your eight house batteries. So if you ever need access to them, to be able to pull out the tray, you're gonna actually have to undo the pins here. So there's one on your left and right hand side. Once those are both out, you can pull that tray and you have access to your eight house batteries. Here is gonna be a optioned in full pass through tray. So it's gonna be manuals. You're gonna have to pull that out yourself, but you can completely pull that out. You can continue to take that. Um, and that'll do it both on this side and the other side as we demonstrated earlier. Push that back in. Here in the next bay, you're gonna have that full pass through tray. So again, if you have any storage space or any equipment, maybe you're going on a hunting trip, this is gonna give you that ample amount of storage for you underneath in your luggage and your equipment. Right next door is going to be your Oasis chin hook system. So it's going to be your heating system. New for the 2022 year is going to be a dual loop. So you can actually heat different zones throughout the coach. Here's going to be your 50 amp rewind reel. So if you are at the campsite and you need to hook up, you can simply pull this out, hook it up. And what's nice is this is gonna be power, so you don't have to manually reel this back in. You can just simply click and hold this. And that'll wind back up for you. And here's gonna be your waterwork system. So what you're gonna see here is a stainless steel plate. So this just gives it a really nice clean look. Um, this obviously has a lot to do with your sewage and water. So you just wanna make it really nice and clean and organized for you. It's also nicely labeled and instructionalized for you. So over here, you're gonna have your supply water, city water and tank fill connection, your water filter, your sewage rinse. You're gonna have your auto and manual fill for your fresh water tank, your water pump light. You're also gonna have your low point drains, which is gonna be your hot and cold drains. You're gonna have your exterior shower here. So if you're hiking or at the beach and you don't wanna take all that um, dirt and grime inside, you can just rinse off out here before you go and shower inside. And then this hose right here, so with that pink liquid, what that means is that this coach has actually been winterized for you. And here is gonna be your duff tank. And then rounding out the bays on the off door side, these are actually gonna connect so they're gonna be full pass through on the horizontal end. So it's gonna give you just, again, ample storage. And I wanna go ahead and point out that these bays, again, as I mentioned on the other side, they're gonna have the insulation on the um, basement here, along with your beet foam sidewalls as well. And then before we move inside, I wanna go ahead and highlight here, it's gonna be the exterior entertainment system. So this does not come standard with this coach, but you can option it in. So you're gonna unlock this and it'll come up for you. And underneath, you're gonna have a 43 inch Samsung TV with a Bose sound bar. Along with that, it can move on a swivel here. So you can just adjust as you need, pull that in or out. You're gonna have two 110V outlets along with two USB ports. And then something you can do with the Bose sound bar here is you can actually have house mode. So you can do the dash radio on the inside if you want to, or if you switch it to TV, it'll play whatever is coming from the TV. So just to 
recap that. If you have it on the TV, whatever's playing here, like the big game or a movie, that sound will come out of the speaker for you. And then if you have it on house mode, whatever's playing on the dash radio will play it out of these speakers. And then above top here, what they have optioned in is gonna be two Nova side awnings. So you're gonna have the full awning that comes out. What standard is just gonna be one of those, the front. And then they also optioned in the carefree window package. So you're gonna have awnings over the windows along with the slide toppers. Moving to the interior of our Ventana 4326, I wanna go ahead and focus on our cockpit area here because this is where you're gonna spend a lot of your time down the road. So over here on your passenger side, your captain seats, both passenger and driver, are gonna be our Villa Comfort Fit. They're also gonna be six-way powered, power lumbar, and they're also both gonna have foot rests. Along with our passenger side here, what you're gonna see in front of me is going to be a passenger workstation. So you're gonna have a nice rubber mat here, so if you have any hot coffee or drink, that's gonna obviously mitigate any spillage. You can work from here or just enjoy a nice meal. And then you can simply just go ahead and put that back down and tuck it to the side there. Along with that, you're gonna have your wireless charging, you're gonna have a step cover and a cup holder. So with that step cover, if you're sitting here in the passenger seat and you don't want your feet to dangle, um, you're gonna just press this out. It's not gonna come all the way because I'm obviously standing here, but this is gonna come all the way out and then it's gonna come up, so it's gonna be a flush step there for you. Along with our passenger side, this is where your battery disconnect is gonna be, along with your um, power button to lock or unlock your baggage doors on the exterior. Along with that, I wanna go ahead and point out our step right here. So with Numar, something we pride ourselves on is a lot of places will just you know, put things there for fashion, uh, for looks. What we do is we try to utilize every part of the coach. So here on both steps, you're gonna have these covers that come up and you're gonna have ample storage underneath. They're gonna be really deep and they're gonna be decently wide. And this is great for um, pet food, dog leashes. I have customers who hike often so they'll put their dirty boots down here. And that just, and obviously being on the steps, you avoid bringing all that dirt into the coach right away. And this can just simply go back down. Along with that is you're gonna see an assist handle here and an assist handle here on the dash. So whether you're coming into the coach or out of the coach, we try to mitigate any falling and we provide those um, supports there for you. Along with that, moving to the dash area, you're gonna have our two-tone dash, which kind of gives it a nice sleeker look. You're also gonna have our large bonded windshield here. As we mentioned on the exterior, um, you're gonna have comfort drive with this. You're also gonna have the passive steer, which I mentioned on our 40 feet and above, you're gonna have that second tag axle in the back. Up here above, you're gonna have an optioned in Samsung TV. This is gonna be 43 inches. So this is not come standard. If you choose to not option this in, it'll just be, um, again, ample storage and cabinet space up here. You're gonna have your control panels underneath and above your driver's seat. So you're gonna become really familiar with this. This is in, gonna include a lot of your power control systems, your Oasis, your Magnum Energy. You're gonna have your um, awnings in or out, along with your security lights and exterior step. And then you're also gonna control your um, off door side and door side slide outs up here as well. Moving here into the driver area, so I wanna go ahead and point out a couple of monitors here. So over here, you're gonna have your navigation system, your radio. You can go into menu here and it'll take you back to the home screen, which brings you your Bluetooth, your serious radio if you option that in. You can go to your camera. So if you option in the 360 view, this is where you're gonna be able to view this on both sides. So this is gonna take you to the rear of the coach currently what you're seeing. You're gonna have your 360 view. So right here is gonna be the coach and you're gonna have that 360 view all the way around, which is super nice. And then this is gonna be the rear end as well. Along with this, you're gonna have the Nav and Go navigation system for this year. So that takes away the Rand McNally. So what's really nice is with the old system, you actually had a um, SIM card that you had to put in and out for any updates. With the Nav and Go system, it's actually gonna be all air updated. So no matter what, it's gonna automatically update for you so you don't have to worry about putting a little SIM card in or out. Over here, you're gonna have the digital dash as well. 
Again, this just gives it kind of a nice clean look. Um, less buttons and just makes it really slick. Down here, you're gonna have your generator along with a couple of other items. You're gonna have storage for your phone. You're also gonna have your um, different entrance locks, your climate control, a 12V outlet along with a USB outlet. You're gonna have your Freightliner chassis again, as we mentioned outside. You're gonna have cup holders, storage out here, your horn. You're gonna have an opening and closing window if you choose. You're also gonna have your equalizer systems here. And then to focus on this, you're gonna have JBL premium audio throughout. So you're gonna have a speaker on your left and your right side. Um, that's gonna be actually really cool is, um, it's gonna be a Harman product as well, which is a huge parent company for us. They're featured in a lot of luxury brands such as Audi um, and Jags and something obviously that's really cool is it's featured in Numar as well. And then over here, you're gonna have your owner support. So with your Ventana, you're gonna get a specialized brand specialist. So whether it's 2 p.m. in the afternoon or it's 2 a.m. in the morning, you can go ahead and call that number and someone's gonna be there to help you, walk you through any technical problems or get you to a service station if needed. Our captain seats, as I mentioned, the power here, they're gonna be our Villa Comfort Fit as well. And as we move into our living room area here of this coach, I wanna go ahead and point out that they went ahead and optioned in our Gotham decor, which you'll see focused on our pillows and our bets red in the back, which we'll point out later. They also went ahead and optioned in our Glacier Glaze Maple cabinets, which come with a matte finish in this coach. This just kind of gives it a nice light and airy look in the coach. So as many as you walk in, it doesn't feel tight or closed in. It's just really nice. And obviously the windows add a little bit more to that. Along with that, you're gonna have our tile floors. So something new for this year, you can actually go ahead and option in the heated flooring. Um, that wasn't available to you before, but it is now, so a lot of people do enjoy that. I would like that today because it's very cold here in Napanee. Um, over here, I want to go ahead and just touch on that. You have your tile floor here um, throughout, but on your slides on the um, off door side, you're going to actually have carpet on this side. Staying focused over here on your door side, you're going to have your 50, 58 inch jackknife sofa. You're going to have a nice large opening window, so this is vented. You're going to have on the left side two 110V outlets along with two USB ports. Right here you're going to see this um, kind of a niche here with a countertop. That's actually going to be your TV. So I'm going to go ahead and demonstrate our televator. So that's going to come up and it's going to bring up a 50 inch Samsung TV real quick. So as this is coming up, the button is going to be located on the opposite side there, but you don't have to hold that button down. All you have to do is simply click up or simply click down. Um, if you, you know, change your mind in the middle of it, click down, it'll stop and immediately go back down for you. But as this is coming up, this is going to be a um, 50 inch Samsung TV here. So this is going to be a LED 4K TV. It's going to be high definition. Along with that, it's going to be associated with a Bose soundbar. So that Bose soundbar is actually going to have little speakers throughout it. So whether you're sitting over here on the door side, the off door side, or you're working in the kitchen, you're actually going to have ample audio throughout no matter what. And moving to the off door side here, directly across from your jackknife and your televator, I want to go ahead and point out our 87 inch high to bed sofa. So this is going to be able to be converted into a sleeper sofa for you. So if you have your children with you or a couple of guests, this can be pulled out. I would say it would fit two to three people comfortably. On each side, you're going to be provided with two 110V outlets along with two USB ports. So that's great for charging or if you want to um, be on your iPad or anything like that, you can plug that in. Right behind here, you're going to have a large living room window. This can actually be opened up for some fresh breeze. You're going to have your wall sconces. So this changes every year, so you're not going to see it and previous coaches. Along with that, it's gonna be brand specific. So you're not gonna see it in a Dutch star and you're not gonna see it maybe in a base star. It's gonna be Ventana specific for you. I wanna go ahead and point out just above your 110V outlets over here on the right hand side is gonna be that televator button. So just as I demonstrated over there on the door side, you're just gonna go ahead and be able to click that up and down. As I mentioned before, you have your tile floors throughout. However, you're gonna have that carpeting on the slide out here 
So what I want to point out here, because I think this is a really good angle to look at it, is this is going to give you that full um, wall slide out view. So you can see that completely goes out. And that obviously just gives you a ton of ample space throughout the coat. And here in our Ventana 4226, what you're going to see in our kitchen is just going to be a lot of class and it's going to have a really nice clean look. So staying focused over here, you're going to have your Whirlpool convection microwave. So this is going to open up. Um, don't be afraid to cook in here. Just kind of test out the temperatures and stuff. Um, there's a customer, you know, that will cook bacon in the microwave. Um, they've also learned how to cook cookies or bread in there. So just play with it a little bit. There's a ton of stuff you can do with that. What you'll see here is going to be our super polished um, solid surface countertops. So this is going to be a really nice clean look and this comes to match with your decor package. We actually make these in-house so um, that's something that's Newmar specific to this coach along with being Newmar specific and handmade here is going to be our cabinets so what you're going to see is going to be our um, cabinets are going to be screwed and glued so they're not going to be staple like a lot of our competitors so if you walk into our coach um, play with these a little bit um, give them a little tug that's not going to move it's not going to adjust and it's going to be quality made just for you over here you can go ahead and option in a dishwasher if you choose to um, if you don't that's actually going to be a cabinet space underneath you're also going to have um, drawers under here along with a couple on the side so these are going to be your soft closed drawers they're going to be really nice and quiet something you can option in is going to be our all electric cooktop so usually this would be a gas burner stove but we went ahead and optioned in the electric induction cooktop. So with this, you're gonna have flush covers. On um, both of them, they're gonna have cutting boards on the side. It's one less thing you have to worry about because it's already included in here. With the induction cooktop, something you can actually do is instead of cooking on the inside, if you are enjoying brunch or something and you wanna be outside, maybe it's for the big game on Saturday, you can actually go ahead and pull this out and take it outside to cook on. So we'll go ahead and just pull this out. There's gonna be little openings on the side. You're gonna go ahead and unplug it. And then you can easily just transfer it outside and plug it in over there. And then when you're finished outside cooking, you can simply just bring that back in. You're gonna plug it back into that outlet back here. Make sure that's flush in the back. Use those handles for you, otherwise you'll get your fingers um, caught in there. And then you can simply just put your covers back on, giving it a nice flushed counter space if you need to cook on it or cut or anything like that. Perfect. And then as I've already kind of touched on some drawers here, again, you're gonna have that flushed counter up here with the sink. So this is gonna be a um, double sink here. So it's gonna be separated here in the middle, but again, you're gonna have that flush countertop. You can cover one up or take that off if you choose. You're gonna have an adjustable handle so that can be moved, that can go up or down. Um, that's gonna be stainless steel. Right behind here, you're gonna see our really pretty grouted backsplash here. So what you're gonna see in house here at Numar is this is actually gonna be, like I just mentioned, it's gonna be grouted. So it's not gonna give that cheap look to it. Um, it's gonna be handmade here in house. It's just gonna be really nice, clean, and modern for you. Right underneath your sink here, you're gonna have a drawer space. So this is where your trash can's gonna be. This is also gonna be considered, um, if you want, you can have an appliance garage down here. So some, maybe your blender, or if you have a coffee maker that's a little bit taller, you can put that underneath there. Up top, as I mentioned and touched on the cabinets here, you're also gonna have a shelf and cabinets in here. So this is gonna be a push to release drawer. So you're gonna pull it out and then you'll push it back in and here click. And then kind of what I mentioned up front with the steps is um, a lot of people just like to put maybe fake drawers in to kind of give it a nicer look. Although we have nice drawers, we actually utilize that space. So, um, and a lot of competitors, this will just be locked. You can't move it or adjust it or put anything in there. With Numar, you can actually open this up and use it maybe as a little spice rack. It's really nice. And then right behind me and above me here, I want to go ahead and focus on a few things. So this is going to be your fantastic vent. 
So um, you're gonna have a really nice pretty covering, which is Newmar as well. So instead of just having that kind of ugly white opening fan, we're gonna have a um, covering that's gonna match your cabinet choice. But along with that, it's gonna have a rain sensor. So even if you have that fan or vent open, you can choose that rain sensor and it's gonna stop it, stop any rain from coming into the coach. Staying focused real quick, I wanna point out the center of the coach. So what you're gonna see here is what looks like just a really pretty classy design on your ceiling. However, something in our new Mars is this is actually going to be where your central AC is located. So a lot of people might um, want or complain that there isn't a bedroom ceiling fan or a ceiling fan here in the living room. But what's nice is that central AC is gonna be here located, again, right in the center of your coach. So it's gonna have full AC throughout, which allows you to put your slides in when you're going down the road. And that AC is gonna come still right here in the center. So it's not gonna have to flood over the side outs or anything like that. And then over here is going to be your dinette area. So this does not come standard, but we went ahead and optioned in our Villa Comfort Fit convertible booth. So what that means is that this can be converted into a sleeper booth for you. Um, I'm actually gonna go ahead and put a picture in here which shows you what that looks like. That's gonna be this big piece of furniture. That's gonna go right in the middle to make it a sleeper for you. But basically what's gonna happen is there's a small black lever under here that you're gonna pull and this is gonna push down. So that's gonna push all the way down, become flush for you. You put your um, cushion back up there and it's gonna become a bed for you. And then right behind your dinette is going to be a two pantry door here. So you're gonna have um, push to close drawers out here. So that kind of mitigates any collision that mitigates them coming out and you're gonna hear that click and that lock. That's letting you know that those are safe and secure. And then to the left of that pantry, you're gonna have another ample um, storage space here. So you can see there's gonna be a hanging rod. There's gonna be a couple of sh sh um, shelves and storage. And they're also gonna have two more pull-out drawers right here as well. And then directly across from your pantry, you're gonna have your Whirlpool fridge. So it's gonna have a um, water dispenser on the front. This is gonna open up. It's gonna be a really nice clean look. You're gonna have your unlock and lock here. Again, make sure that's locked when you're in motion because you don't want that to open up on you. You're gonna have your freezer underneath with a ice maker down here. And then you're gonna have a ton of storage. Um, it's gonna be two levels underneath in the freezer. And as we move our way into our midship of our uh, 4326 Ventana, I wanna go ahead and point out this mysterious door here. So what's cool about this floor plan is actually gonna be a bunk model. So those are gonna swivel open. And what you're gonna see here is you're gonna have your bunks. So this is gonna be a maximum capacity of 250 pounds. But the nice thing about the bunks is it comes with a really cute ladder. So you can attach that so you can easily get in or out. You can also actually lower this or remove it so you can actually have a massive ward if you choose to. You'll see that hanging rod up here as well. There's gonna be reading lights underneath um, on the ceiling here for both bunks. You're also gonna have two 110V outlets along with the USB ports. You're gonna have those over here again on the right hand side but no USB on this side. They went ahead and optioned in the TVs and DVD and satellite setup for both bunks. So that does not come standard, but you can option that in. Along with something they optioned in is going to be the bunk window. So normally that's just gonna be, again, that sidewall and wall board, but they went ahead and put in the windows there. So as I touched on um, a few times is our storage here at Newmar. So what might just look like a nice decoration on the bottom, this is actually gonna be some storage as well. So that can open up. This can be t-shirts or clothing or shoes or whatever you might fit, just some miscellaneous items down here. De directly across from your bunks here, so you're gonna have a midship bath. It's gonna be a half bath, so it does not come with a shower, but that does come with a commode. Um, obviously some ample storage. We'll go ahead and open up the cabinets in here. So you're gonna have your control system, 
You're gonna have a medicine cabinet behind the sink. You're also gonna have your black backsplash and a um, Corian bowl. Again, more storage. You're gonna have your um, another fantastic vent up top, so you can go ahead and adjust that. You're gonna have two 110 outlets along with your lighting. And then right behind me, you're gonna have just again, more ample storage for you no matter what. So it's really nice because if in the middle of the night, your kids or guests don't wanna obviously go through the master bedroom to get there, they can go right across. And um, something too with this is they can actually access this or you guys can access this when the slides are in. So here at Newmar, they went ahead and engineered a swivel door on the hinge. So this allows you to open that door up while the slides are in and you can comfortably go to the restroom if needed. Directly to the left here and across from your bunks, you're gonna have a, another ward here. So whether that's for clothes, jackets, or anything of that nature, you can also put maybe some food products or um, appliance storages or whatever you might need here. And then staying right here, you're also gonna have your um, option in central vac system. So that doesn't come standard, but if you choose to option that in, um, instead of worrying about bringing in a sweeper and dustpan or anything, you can actually just sweep it right into that central vac system. That'll turn on and sweep all that dust and grime out into that bay four, which we pointed out earlier. And then you'll simply just close it back up. It'll turn off and you'll be good to go. And before making our way into the master bedroom, I want to go ahead and point out here. So normally you'll see what comes standard is your pocket doors up to your master bedroom. What's nice about the 4326 with the bunk model is going to actually be two sets of those pocket doors. So we're going to go ahead and open this up. So let's say you want to close off your guests from the living room if you have people sleeping out there. You have your children here in the midship bath with the bunks. And now mom and dad are going to bed. You're just gonna simply lock and the kids are gonna have their own oasis back here with that midship bath. You're just gonna go ahead and open this up and close it out. And now that we're here in the master bedroom here, I wanna go ahead and point out that the slide out is gonna be here on your right hand side. So that's gonna be your bedroom side. Again, that's gonna be carpeted on that slide here. Your dresser setup is gonna be two hanging wards on your left and right hand side with a 43 inch Samsung TV in the middle. This is gonna be that LED 4K TV. You're gonna have a vented egress window right here along with ample um, counter space and drawers underneath. And just as we have in the kitchen, you're also gonna have those soft closed drawers as you just saw there, along with the nice quiet cabinets here. And then what comes standard with your 4326 is going to be a king size bed. You're gonna have on um, both right hand sides, um, right hand and left hand side of the bed. It's going to be your 110V outlets along with two USBs. You're going to have some a little bit of storage underneath. So if you want to put your phone away for the night, you can do that. You're going to have a really pretty headboard with a mirrored backdrop, just giving it a little bit more of a sexier look back here with some ample storage above top. Within that storage, again, you're going to have um, 110V outlets. So you're never going to shy away from outlets back here. Right underneath, you're gonna have some control panels. So you're gonna have your reading lights if you choose to turn those on. Those can be operated one off of one. So if you're ready for bed, but say your husband's not, he can keep his reading light on and you can turn yours off. On each side, you're also gonna have your vented opening windows there. And then as I mentioned before, this is gonna be our Gotham decor package. And before we step into the master bathroom, I wanna go ahead and point out here, just as we mentioned in the living room and kitchen area, you're gonna have that central AC here with that really nice clean ceiling um, treatment up top. So again, even when that bedroom slide is in, that AC is not gonna to have to tumble over that slide out to get, keep you cool. Um, it's actually just gonna be right here for you. So even when that slides in, you're gonna have AC in the front and the back as well. Staying real quick before we enter, I wanna go ahead and point out our half smoked mirror here. 
and along with the mirror behind the headboard which I pointed out earlier so that's just going to give it a really nice sexy look back here in the master bedroom and bathroom and as we're stepping our way in um, I want to go ahead and point out that there is a step into it so just be careful making our way into the master bathroom here so as you saw out in the front of the coach you're going to have the matching solid surface countertops back here with an undermounted sink you're going to have stainless steel appliances along with a medicine cabinet back here so what you're going to see is going to be almost like a carpet feel back here so this just helps mitigate any movement of maybe your um, toothbrush or cleansers or anything like that you're going to have a matching backsplash to your kitchen so it gives it an all-around full look throughout the coach no matter where you're at along with storage you're going to have a couple cabinets and drawers again you're going to have those stainless steel um, handles here and hardware throughout over here to the left of me you're going to have a optioned in stacked splendid washer and dryer so if you don't option this in you're going to have the prep for the washer and dryer and then you're going to have a ward instead over here to the right you're going to be able to open this up and it's going to go ahead and close right back into this little corner here so it's going to be a perfect fit for you you're going to have a safe back here optioned in and then you're going to have the ward with a hanging rod as well and you can simply just close this back up and then directly across from your ward here is going to be your 35 inch rounded shower so this is going to be your lock and unlock and it's going to slide both ways and then I'm going to go ahead and step in here real quick, but I want to go ahead and mention that you have an option in um, shower seat in here and the um, shower floors and walls is going to be our central. So I'm going to go ahead and sit down here so you can kind of see a little bit more behind me. So you're going to have a assist handle here. You're going to have your stainless steel products behind me along with your detachable shower head and a um, standstill shower above you so you can actually have two if you choose to and then what you're also going to see is going to be our aqua view miser system so essentially what that means is when you are ready to get into the shower but it's not quite warm yet and maybe you're dry camping you don't want to drain any water and waste that so instead of having the water come out first what you're going to do is you're going to flip this switch on to recycle so it's going to basically just recycle that water through a tube for you and it's going to become warm and once it's warm and ready for you this light's going to turn blue letting you know that hey the shower is at a ample temperature for you to get in flip that back on and the water is going to dispense for you i'm going to go ahead and just move out of here real quick and then um, i want to go ahead and point out our um, kind of the sky window here so this also provides additional headspace so if you're a little bit taller like my cameraman here that actually gives you an additional probably four to five to six inches in addition to that clearance as well and then over here opposite of your shower you're going to have your commode along with your egress door so because it is so windy i don't want to damage anything but you can go look back at a couple of our last videos and i'll demonstrate how to open this but basically you're going to unlock it this is going to be a handle that you also have to unlock it's gonna open up for you, and this is gonna come off as a magnetic board, and it's just gonna have a drop-down ladder. So um, a lot of our competitors, their egress um, doors are actually, they'll fall out, so they're a one-time use. With us, you can reuse this as many times as you need. So in the case of an emergency, hopefully that never happens to you, you can use this. Um, a lot of our customers will also use it for um, packing their camper. So if um, you're in a 43-foot, 43 uh, uh, coach you can actually have people loading up the front while someone's loading stuff into the back here as well thank you for coming along and exploring the difference of our ventana 4326 for the 2022 model year i know we covered a lot of ground today so i want to just go ahead and highlight a few things that we mentioned feature on the exterior graphics is going to be our Mel belmont graphics on the inside you're going to have our gotham decor along with our optioned in glacier glazed maple matte finish cabinets the main highlight and focus of this entire video was to point out that this 4326 is actually going to be our bunk model for the ventana brand so with those bunk models you can actually convert them into a hanging ward if you choose to which just provides more ample storage and space so if you don't have your kids traveling with you you can go ahead and remove that top bunk make that into a ward and then again if you have the kids traveling with you you're going to have your 
two bunks in the midship. You're gonna have your master bedroom. You're also gonna have a standard um, high to bed sofa up here, which is 87 inches. So that can fit two to three people comfortably. Along with that, you can go ahead and option in like we did here, the Villa Comfort Fit convertible booth, which is another sleeper. So no matter what, if you're going to the local campground or you're traveling across country, you're gonna have ample sleeping space, whether that's for your kids, your guests, or anyone that you know you might meet up with on the road. So if you have any questions, don't hesitate to reach us here at Newmark Sales or Service. And I want to go ahead and point out too, if you want to see a little bit more behind the scenes of our production, um, I know I mentioned, you know, we do our backsplash in-house with the grout, we do our countertops in-house, the cabinets, they have that little um, touch of love with Newmar, that difference. You can go ahead and feature that on our um, virtual tour online, and I'll go ahead and put the link right here below me. Again, I'm Megan Stouter, and I'll see you next time.